Can medication for high blood pressure cause ringing in the ears? Typically, the job of those pills is to lower your blood pressure. So can it lead to tinnitus as a side effect? Let's find out. This is Pure Tinnitus. Hey, my name is Dr. Ben, audiologist and tinnitus specialist in California. So typically, high blood pressure medication does not directly cause tinnitus. Loop diuretics are one form of medication that can be used for high blood pressure, and in high doses, they can be ototoxic, they can be damaging to the ears. So there's a small chance that loop diuretics could cause tinnitus for you. Loop diuretics are used to increase the production of urine, and that kind of medication is used for high blood pressure, heart failures, or kidney disorders. High blood pressure is directly related to stress. If you have high stress, you're gonna have an increase in blood pressure, higher blood pressure, and if you have have high stress, you're also going to have an increase in the reaction to tinnitus or ringing in your ears. So asking the question, can high blood pressure medication cause tinnitus? Usually not, but increase in stress can cause higher blood pressure, a spike in blood pressure. It can also cause a spike in tinnitus. So you may or may not have noticed that you have some very low soft ringing in your ears and during periods the tinnitus can be louder because there's some stress going on in your body as well. So that stress is caused from a reaction of your emotional brain to certain things in your environment or it's caused from your actual body being put on high alert part of our nervous system being sent a message that we need to be on high alert and that creates an increase in the tinnitus. The relationship between tinnitus ringing in your ears and medication can be very complex. So I recommend that you talk to your primary doctor if you have more specific questions about the medications you're taking and if there's any side effects that could lead to ringing in the ears. If you learned anything from this video, give us a thumbs up below because if you don't, YouTube does not recommend our video to anyone else. You can press that red subscribe button and to stay up to date with our new tinnitus education video coming out every single week and tap that notification bell so YouTube lets you know when it comes out. We also have a free newsletter for all things tinnitus. My name is Dr. Ben and remember to take your journey one step at a time.